guys, so first off, new location. I'm actually in my parents' house and this is my mom's craft room where she does her crafts and stuff. So there's like paint over there and other stuff behind me and stuff all over the place. So I know some girls have like a makeup room, but my mom has a craft room. So um, anyway, so this or today's video is going to be about an event that I went to this past weekend. It was for, um, I guess, a company or a website type um, situation called Beautylish. Um, in my last video, my vlog uh, video that I posted just before this one, I had mentioned the company in that video as well. Um, it's basically a website where um, beauty bloggers and bloggers and vloggers such as myself can kind of um, talk about different products. You can also post your YouTube videos if you are someone that does that. Um, and kind of just communicates other people that are into the same things that you are. So it's kind of like the YouTube beauty community. You take that, but you kind of expand it so that you can talk to um, people about this stuff more than just going on YouTube. So I do have my own account on Beautylish, which I've mentioned before. Um, and so this event that they had was basically for all of us beauty bloggers and vloggers in the LA area to get together to kind of have... Um, the event was called Beautylish LA Day of Beauty. So they had um, like manicures, they had makeup artists to like do your makeup and whatnot. They had food, they had cupcakes, they had like an open bar. So it was really cool and they also had like um, little jars of like things you can take like that has like chopsticks and all kinds of things which I'll show you in a bit. Um, so yeah, I'm, I got invited because like I said I am a member of the Beautylish website so they sent me an email about a week or two prior to the event. Um, but there also were some really well-known gurus that were there as well. Some of the bigger names that you may have heard of that were there, um, there was Queen of Blending, which her name is Lauren. Um, there was Susie, which is a Mac NC40. There was Miss Glamorazzi, who's Ingrid. Um, Essie Castaneda, which is Sonia, who I've mentioned in a previous video before. And there was J-Love's Mac 1. Is there a number at the end? I think it's J-Love's Mac 1, I think. Um, or her name is Jarmaine. So I think that was pretty much all of the bigger gurus that you would know of that were there. Um, if you haven't heard any of those gurus before, I'll put their links to their channels um, down below in the description box because they're really great channels. All of them have really good channels and videos. Um, but a friend of mine, Tammy, who she also, she's a beauty blogger. Um, her website is lazybeautiful.com and I'll leave the link to her channel below as well. Um, I met her through my sister-in-law. She's actually friends with my sister-in-law and I've met her a couple times so that's how we know each other. So um, at least I had her to like hang out with and whatnot. So that was cool. So she actually, I was debating on whether or not to go to this event because I was nervous about, I'm not a very social person at all. I'm pretty quiet. Um, as weird as that may seem since I'm able to do these videos, but when you're actually socializing, it's a whole nother situation. Um, but anyway, she pretty much talked me into going. So I was like, okay, might as well. Like, like what can, what is there to lose? You know, if I'm feeling awkward or uncomfortable, I could always leave. Um, so anyway, I went, I had a great time. Um, I didn't approach any of the gurus that were there. Um, like the more well-known ones that I mentioned before just because I felt kind of, I'm just I'm so awkward I swear um, the only one I really talked to was Queen of Blending because she just happened to be standing there when I was at the bar getting a drink um, So I talked to her for a second, but so she's really cool I didn't take any pictures or video there when I was at the event because I totally forgot my camera and the camera on my cell phone kind of sucks So that's why I don't have any kind of visuals of that But um, if you check out any of the gurus that I mentioned before that check out their um, blogs or their Twitter accounts Because a lot of them took pictures during the event. So um, yeah, like I said, I'll link all that below So the event was at the JW Marriott, which is pretty much in the heart of downtown LA It was right by the Staples Center, the Nokia Theater, the Los Angeles Convention Center So it was really cool to actually go down to downtown because it's been a long time since I've been down there. So it was at a really nice hotel. It was like super nice. Um, so when you go into the event and everything, you get a little name tag that said your name. Um, and then you get a raffle ticket because they had like a little raffle going on as well. But when you go inside, they have like um, all these tables that had little kind of bases full of free products. So when I actually left the event, I got this whole bag of goodies full of makeup stuff and all that. And so... Um, everything I'm going to show you is going to be a mixture of what was in this goodie bag as well as the things that were just in the jars that you could grab. So I'll start with got this thing from NYX. It had a little tie on it, but I already opened it and took advantage of everything. But it um, came with the NYX products and it comes with um, a lip pencil, a lipstick, and a blush. So the NYX lip pencil is in the color Pinky, so it's just a bright pink lip liner. I got a lipstick looks like this. Um, the color is in 598 Christy. So it looks like this. Kind of like a frosty pink color. And then the blush, which I'm really excited for the blush because like in my previous video I was seeing how I wanted to build my blush collection. So got this NYX blush and the color is an angel so it's just kind of a soft light pink. 
I'm actually wearing it today. So it's really good probably for um, more fair skin tones because I think if you have a more of a tan, it might not show up as well. But for me, we've also got these two Orly nail polishes. And this is from their Cosmic um, Effects collection. Um, let's see. This one right here, this is kind of like a bluish green type color. Super pretty. And this one is called Galaxy Girls. So this was actually... This nail polish is one of them that was just sitting in one of in those vases that you could just grab. So I got this color, and then this one was in the goodie bag. And this is called Space Cadet, so it's more of like a yellowy pink color. Really pretty. I've tried them both already before I painted my nails and love them. Then also in the little jars where you could grab um, different things, I have I got these three NYX glitters. Um, when you were when the little jars were sitting out, you're only supposed to grab one of each just so that everybody can get some but towards the end of the event when everybody was leaving or pretty much everybody was gone almost by the time I left and there was still jars full of stuff so I went at first I just grabbed this green one really pretty green glitter and this is in lime and then since nobody had picked out the other colors I decided to grab two more so this one is called just green so it's kind of like a darker green color compared to this one. And then the last one I got is called Ruby, so it's a really pretty kind of reddish pink color. So I'm not sure if these are safe for your eyes or not, so I have to kind of do some research on it to see. I don't want to put it on my eyes and then it gets in my eyes and then I'm having vision problems, but I have to look it up to see if they're good for eyes and if they are, then look out for a tutorial for that. I also got these soothing eye gel little packets. And this is by the brand, I thought the brand, because I've had a lotion called Yes to Carrots, so I thought the brand was just called Yes to Carrots, but I guess they have Yes to Cucumbers too, which is what these are. Um, so they're just, they've got three little packets and they're just, um, it says it smooths and brightens. 99.6% natural ingredients. I've been looking for an eye cream, so hopefully this works out really well so I can buy it a full size of it later, so I'll let you know how that goes. Then I also got this other thing by Yes to Carrots, or Yes to, I guess the brand's called, and these are soothing hyperallergenic uh, facial towelettes. So it says, uh, Yes to Cucumbers and Aloe Vera to cleanse, to cleanse, remove makeup, and nourish skin all in one swipe. So that should be interesting. I love free products. <laughs> and then also in the little jars that you could pick random things out, there were these lip balms. And these are also by Yes to Carrots. So the others were Yes to Cucumbers, and these are Yes to Carrots. So these were the little freebie things. The first one I picked out, because like I said, I only grabbed one at first, but then when no one was um, picking out the rest of this stuff, when everybody was leaving, I grabbed a couple more. So um, the first one I got was the mint one. So there's that. I already opened that one. I love mint, so that's why I grabbed that one initially. So um, And then I grabbed these other three. There's a citrus one. These ones I haven't opened yet, but this is citrus, uh, there's a berry one, and then this is carrot. So I'm interested in learning how, or seeing how the carrot one's going to taste. But and also in the goodie bag, I got this Stila uh, Cheek and Lip Stain, and it says Akai Crush, so I guess that's the color name. I'm actually wearing it on my lips right now with just some gloss over it. Um, but it looks like this outside of the packaging. And then it's one of those where you pull the cap off and it comes... A little brush so you would just twist the bottom and the product just comes through the brush so that's really cool I, like I said I'm wearing it on my lips right now it's like it really when I say it's a stain it's super like it really stains like these are my fingers because I was blending out the product and now my fingers are just stained then I got another Stila lip gloss and this is in the same kind of container where you would twist the bottom and it comes out of the brush um, this actually wasn't in the goodie bag it was one of, in one of the um, on one of the tables where you can just pick however many and this color is in Marvelous. Really pretty. They had like different shades of, of colors you can pick, but they had pinks and stuff. And I have a lot of pink lip glosses and lipsticks, so that's why I went for more of like this kind of dark mauve kind of color. So I've already tried it, love it. Then also in one of the freebie tables, I got this lip gloss and it's called, or it's by the brand uh, Napoleon Purtis or Purtis. I'm not sure, but this is what the packaging looks like little leopard and then you open it up. I actually tore off the box because I was like that excited to open it. But there's like a fly in here driving me crazy. Anyway, so it looks like this outside of the packaging. Really cool. It's kind of like a coral melon color. Super pretty. And then the very last thing um, on the freebie tables, they had a bunch of these little lollipops. 
So I got a bunch of these. I got six because nobody was taking them. So I got all of these, of course. I love lollipops. And they were like flavors I've never even had before, like cotton candy and strawberry shortcake and blueberry savannah. I don't know. But anyway, <laughs> so those are always fun. So anyway, um, if you haven't heard of Beautylish, I definitely recommend checking out the website, especially if you're a beauty blogger or vlogger like myself. Um, I'll put the link from my account as well as just the website's um, address down in the description box. So um, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I should still be in LA for probably, it, it's seriously only been like five days, I think. Today's actually my anniversary, so I'm kind of bummed out. That's why I'm making this video, to keep myself occupied. If there's, if there's anything you want to see, like maybe, I was thinking about doing a vlog, like putting a, putting together a vlog of different things of when I'm going out around LA, maybe when I'm in the Valley or if I'm in Hollywood, something like that. So maybe I'll put something like that together for you guys to see. Um, especially for those of you who've never been to LA and you want to see what it's like. Um, even though it's not typical LA weather right now, it's totally gloomy, so that's why I look kind of blue right now on the camera for some reason. I'm not blue, I promise. <laughs> anyway, so what is going on? What is that? Cool. Need a bobby pin. Anyway, so anyway, I hope you guys um, enjoyed this video, and until my next one, I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.